Why are you home so late? Hurry and eat dinner. I'm not hungry. Why were his eyes so red? Was he crying? Has he been under too much pressure from school? Or maybe he's getting bullied at school? The last time he cried was probably in kindergarten. A few days ago, I saw you with a man in a black suit outside of the convenience store. A black suit? I think I remember. That person has been following me lately. No, he's been following for a long time. I can't say when it started. So he's been stalking you? Have you called the police? It's no use. If I'm not wrong, he was sent by my father to watch over me and my mother. Even if I get a restraining order against him, there will surely be a second and a third to replace him. Even if we move houses or go to another city, nothing will work. So, when I saw you with that person, I wondered if you were with him or if you had some relationship with my father. Sorry. I don't think I've ever heard Wayne talk about his father before. He even sent someone to follow him. Is he a dangerous person? Dangerous? Before I traveled back in time, did Vayun also encounter dangerous situations like this in 10th grade? If I hadn't grabbed Vayun just then, would he have? I traveled back in time in the hopes of letting Wayun avoid the car accident. Is it because I've been too comfortable lately? I met Wayun again for the first time and we slowly got to know each other again. Becoming close with Wayun always feels easy. Two years before the accident, I let my guard down. Will Vayun encounter an incident even more dangerous than the car incident that happened after the college entrance exam? Today's event were like a warning from the heavens. Warning me that I can't let my guard down and do not believe that Bayon is safe just yet. Reminding me that I was the one who caused the accident that I killed Bayon. Maybe I should act indifferent like how Bayon has been acting around me recently. We shouldn't have gotten too close. As long as Bayon doesn't come to like me, then the car accident won't ever happen. What? You came back so late. The food is already cold. Mom's heating some up for you. I said I wasn't hungry. I 
I'll lend it to you for a week. Why now? So don't cry anymore. It's so ugly. I wasn't crying. Mm, hurry and go eat. I already said I'm not. How is he? Is he going to come in? Yes. Then he should be fine. I'm hungry. Who was it that said they weren't a few moments ago? It definitely wasn't me. If you were any later, I'd have thrown the food out already. Hurry and go eat. Your mom has already heated it up for you. When did I heat it up? Yeah, yeah, you didn't heat it. I can't keep going on like this. There may be other dangerous hidden right next to Wayun. I have to raise my spirit. I have to get rid of any hidden danger. I'm so tired, I couldn't sleep well last night. It's Vayun. Yesterday, Vayun said that the person who has been following him may have started a long time ago, but he only recently found out about it. So maybe that person is watching Vayun from nearby. Let me see if there are any suspicious people around. Yu Tung, what are you doing? Rayun, I'm looking for suspicious people. Maybe the person who's been following you is also nearby. You should also be careful. I still think it's better to call the police. Oh, that's right. Is there also someone monitoring Rayun inside the school? I've seen many TV series and novels with that kind of situation. Anyway, it's better to be on guard. Wayne, do you think there are people monitoring you at school? Do you have any suspicions? No. If you do, just tell me. I'll help you get rid of them. Okay. I can trust him, right? Hey, watch out. Be careful. Sorry. Does it hurt? Oh, it's fine. It doesn't hurt. It actually started raining. Let's go back. I didn't bring an umbrella. Zichin, did you bring an umbrella? Yeah, but I'm going to pick up Yuling at her school. Three people using one umbrella? I'm reluctant. I'll 
I brought one. Do you want to go home together? I'm glad you bought an umbrella, or else I'd be drenched when I got home. I always have an umbrella in my backpack just in case. You should walk on the inside. Is he letting me walk on the inside because there's a car passing by? Let's use a footpath later. There are way too many cars on the main road, okay? I'll never let Mayun run into danger like last time. I want to protect him. That car was driving way too fast. You didn't get slashed by any water, right? No. He's blushing again. That scared me. Just suddenly hugged me. I'm getting a bit too close with Bayon again. I should keep some distance from him. Fuck, I got drenched in rain. The rain. Why do I feel like the area covered by the umbrella has gotten smaller? It's because the umbrella is crooked. Why don't let me hold it? It feels weird touching Wayne's hand. I'm taller than you. You'll be tired if you keep your hand up, won't you? What? You're only a bit taller than me. Let me hold it. Then even out the umbrella a bit. Okay, I still think they're still a bit smaller. Come a bit closer. For some reason, seeing Yuton's expressions always make me want to tease him more. Whatever, it's just sharing an umbrella. Close contact is inevitable. What the hell are those two doing? Yuzong, have you ever been to Wayne's house before his birthday? It seems like he only invited you. Yeah. You're the only one in the class who's close to Wayun, aren't you? I think Wayun usually just keeps to himself and reads book. He doesn't talk to others much. He likes reading more than anyone else I've met. I don't know why, but I feel like Wayun has intentionally been trying to keep his distance from others. Really?
Yeah, it's not that he's an introvert who doesn't get along with others, but it feels like he doesn't want to have much contact with other people. He's still very polite though. I feel bad when disturbing him. Yeah, I'm also a bit scared to talk to him. But he seems pretty happy to help people solve problems. His grades are so high. Why is he a member of the student committee? Is Vayun intentionally trying to keep his distance from others? I never noticed. Who wants to sign up for the women's long jump? Next is the registration for the men's teams. Finally, the school sport meet is coming up. It's, it's gonna be fun. I'll participate in the relay race. Speaking of, I participated in the relay race with Vayun before. Vayun participated in the 3000 meter race and he even got the first place. Vayun, are you planning on participating in any events? No, how come? You have such good physical strength. And you can run fast. You will definitely win an award if you participate. I'm not as good as you say I am. If you win a prize, your mom will be happy. Before when Mayun and I won the awards, Auntie was so happy that she took us to the amusement park. Does anyone else want to sign up for the 4x400 meter men's race? I do. Lin Yutong and Kin Weyun. Why did you suddenly want to participate? Um, because I suddenly wanted to participate? Then the third runner will be Weyun and the fourth runner will be Yutong. The men's 3,000 meter race. This one, this one, you'll definitely be able to get the first place. What if I don't get the first place? If you don't get the first place, I'll get first place in the final exams. What a surprise. I thought Vayun wouldn't participate in these kind of activities. Not only does he study well, he seems to be good at sports too. I feel like Yutong encouraged him to participate.
Megan, you actually signed up for the 3,000 meter race? You're so brave. Good luck. Thank you. It's true. Mayor doesn't initiate when talking to someone. He only opens his mouth to respond. Is he really trying to keep his distance from others? Before, if there were any activities in class or in school, Wayne wouldn't participate on his own. Just like in class today, he only participated because I urged him to. Is he just not interested in these things, or does he find them troublesome? What is it? But as long as you mention his mom, he immediately changes his mind. You decided to participate in the competition because you wanted to make your mom happy, right? That's not it. You also have a cute side to you. Oh, sorry. What happened last time? Are you still not satisfied after getting beat up? Oh, giving up so easily? Mayun, if someone talks trash about you, you can't just endure it. After talking shit, he got beaten up and now look at him. Yeah. Some scumbags just like to bully people who have no friends. Like Vayun, it seems that... People who have only one friend are the easiest to target. Oh, I remember now. During the sports meeting, I saw Wayne being blocked in by some seniors. I think that was in grade 10. It's been so long, I almost forgot about it. Weyun? Please don't ever leave my side at the sports meeting. Don't leave your side? Why? Uh, I don't know whether someone will be watching you like that guy just now. If you're alone and run into those guys, you'll be in trouble. Indeed, after I got to know Yutong at school, the people who seek trouble, like those guys just now, haven't shown up as much. Wanna walk home together? What's up? Aren't you going to your club meeting? I don't need to go today.
Yutong, do you want to play ranked matches together tonight? Okay, is it just you? Yeah, Jia Jia isn't free tonight. Yutong has a lot of friends. Is it because of his personality? I feel like everyone likes to play with him. Wayne, do you want to play with us? What are you playing? It's a mobile game. I can teach you. I can play for a bit after I finish my homework. He really is the same, inside and out. I feel comfortable hanging out with him. I feel a bit sorry for suspecting him before. Hiring part-time for weekends. What? Go to school to practice for the relay in a bit? I can. Have you guys called Wayun yet? You don't have his number? Then I'll call him. Why isn't he picking up? What? You want me to buy a few milk teas? Why can't you just drink water? For so many people? Hello, what would you like to order? Wayne, why are you here? I'm going to be working here part-time on the weekends. Back then, I found out Wayne was working here during winter break. So he was already working here before the sports meet? Oh, I see. I'd like to order a few milk teas. This one, this one, and this one. Okay. All oh, right, we have to go to school later to practice for the relay. You won't be able to go, right? Yeah, I can't. Then when do you get off work? I can practice with you when you're free. Okay, I'm working now, so I'll call you in the evening when I'm back home. I'm going to buy a milk tea. Huh? Hurry up then. It's those two. Wait. Huh? I bought so many. I'll probably have to wait for a while. I want Peach all along. Okay. Excuse me. Can I get your number? Huh? Are you talking to me? Yeah. I've seen you around for a while. I was wondering if I could get your number. Huh? 
Huh? A pretty girl is hitting on me?